Well, our study was looking at the frequency of um, key sleep disorders in community dwelling elderly. Um, basically, what we did was that we took participants who were a part of the Mayo Clinic Study of Aging, which is a community-based um, study that emphasizes and looks at the concept of mild cognitive impairment, and um, looked at some of the key features that informants had answered uh, as a part of the Mayo Sleep Questionnaire. And um, the Mayo Sleep Questionnaire is um, basically is a questionnaire that looks, it's a screening measure that looks at um, potential key sleep disorders, um, such as REM sleep behavior disorder, periodic limb movements of sleep, restless leg syndrome, sleep-related leg cramps, obstructive sleep apnea, and sleepwalking. And um, what we had found was that um, informants who had completed the Mayo Sleep Questionnaire, um, these were informants who lived in the same um, facility as the participant and also um, slept in the same room as a participant, therefore hopefully getting a more accurate um, account of what the, the, the participant does at night. What we found was that in the 892 um, participants who had completed information, 59% um, had at least one of the um, features that suggested one of these sleep disorders. So the most common one was the sleep-related related leg cramps. Um, next after that was obstructive sleep apnea, periodic limb movements of sleep, um, REM sleep behavior disorder, restless leg syndrome, and um, sleepwalking. This was a questionnaire-based study. Um, so in order to confirm our findings, the best, the next step is to look at community dwelling elderly, not only do a, a screening questionnaire, but also do a polysomnogram to hopefully confirm some of these, um, some of these results. Um, we do have a validation study ongoing um, where we've looked at people who have filled out the um, Mayo Sleep Questionnaire and also compared the results of those who had a clinical polysomnogram. And the sensitivity is quite high for um, these, these uh, sleep disorders, um, but at the same time the sensitivity can vary um, depending on which disorder we're, we're uh, looking at.